welcome to our recorded class. This is the pre-kinder level. The date today is December 10, 2021. It is a Friday and we always say good morning. Good morning to you, Kyle and Marcos. We will start first with a review for today's class. And part of our review is to do the sight words. So the first word that we have here is the word on. O and the letter N makes the word on. What is our sentence for the word on? Let's do this one first. The word on. The king sits on a throne. The king sits on a throne. We have the word on. O-N-N, on. What else has the word on? We have the word on. I will turn on the light. I will turn on the light. We have the word on. Another sentence with the word on, we have on. The hot kettle is on the stove. The hot kettle is on the stove. We have the word on. O-N-N, -N, on. How about another word? This is the word want. W-A-N and the letter T, want. Want. What's our sentence with the word want? We have want here. I want to play with the kitten. I want to play with the kitten. We have the word want. W-A-N-T. Want. Want. How about the next one? We still have the word want. I want to see the Katie did. I want. To see the katydid. A katydid is a kind of insect part of the grasshopper family. And the body of the katydid, it looks like a leaf, see? And it makes a loud sound and I will let you hear it. Let me play the sound. Let me play it again. That's the sound of the Katie did. Now, how about we move on to another sentence with the word want. We have want. I want to play the kazoo. I want to play the kazoo. And the kazoo is a kind of instrument. When you blow into it, it will make a buzzing sound. So how about I play the sound of the kazoo? You have to listen. Let me play it again. That's the sound of the kazoo. Now let's move on to the next part of our class. And that is to do our counting. So I will check the number for you and you can count with me there on your seat. Let's count together. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty, thirty-one, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight. 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, and 50. That's from 1 to 50. Now we're done counting. Let's move on to sorting our words. So yesterday, we sorted our K words. And there are words that has the sound in the beginning, in the middle, and in the end. So how about for the first one, we have sync. Where do we put it? S ink. S ink. Where's the k sound? S ink. It goes at the end. Sink has the k sound at the end. Next, we have kin. K -i -n. K -i -n. Kin is in the beginning. How about kink? Kink. It goes in the beginning. How about book? B -o -k -b Ook. It's in the end. How about yak? Y-a-k. Y-a-k. 
yak is at the end also. How about qualak? Qualak, qualak, qualak. It's at the beginning. How about basket? Basket, basket. It's in the middle. How about kiwi? E we, e we. It's in the beginning. How about monkey? Monkey, monkey. It's in the middle. How about milk? M ilk, m ilk. It's in the end. How about kite? Kite, kite. Kite is in the beginning. How about key? K e y, k e y. It's in the beginning. And the last one, ukulele. 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 It's in the middle. So these are the words that we sorted. Oops, sorry. Let me fix that. These are the words that we sorted. The ones with the beginning sound, middle sound, and end sound, K. So how about we move on? The next part of our class is to have our lesson. And we still have to do the words that has the K sound. So the first one, we have a boy and his name is Ken. We have K-E-N. Ken. Let's sound out the letters k -e -n, k -e -n, to make the word Ken. And let's spell the name of Ken. K-E-N, Ken. Now we have capital K because it's a name. A name of a person needs to have capital letter first. So K-E-N, Ken. Another K word, the baby goat is called a kid. Let's have the letters K-I-D and sound it k the k -i the kid. Let's spell the word kid. K I D kid. The baby goat is a kid. Another one. This is the kin. You are the kin of your mommy and your daddy. K I N k -i -n, k -i -n, kin. And let's spell it out. K I N kin. Kin. Another one, you have the kit. You put the medicine and also the bandages and ointment in the kit. K I T kit. K I T K I T kit. Kit. K I T kit. Kit. Another one, we have kick. When you do the sport karate, you kick a lot. So this is kick. Kick has the k sound. K I C and K. -k. Let's sound it. K -i -k -k. K -i -k -k. And remember, if we have letter C and letter K, they both have the same letter sound, but they are different letters. So K I C K, that makes the word kick. K I C and K, kick. Kick. Another K word is the kiss. When you show your love to your mommy and your daddy, you kiss them, right? So what are the letters in kiss? K-I-S-S. -S. Let's sound it. K-I-S-S. Kiss. Kiss. And let's spell it out. K-I-S-S. -S. Kiss. Kiss. Now let's move on to some words that has the K sound. At length. And let's sound it out and let's check if it's behind the star, if it's the correct picture. It should match the word. K -e -g, k -e -g, keg. Keg. This is the word keg. And the keg is a big container. It's a barrel with a top. You can put your water in there. So is this our keg? Yes, that's a keg. Another K word. E -y -k -e -y. This has long letter E, just like in eagle. And the letter Y at the end, Y sound. Key. Now, is this the word key? This is key. And is this the picture? Key. Yes, we use the key to open lock doors or maybe your lock car. Another one, we have k -i -d -k -i -d kid. Kid, now there's another kid word, and that is you. You are a child, you're also a kid. And just like the girl here, you're also like her, a kid. 
Next, we have another word. And this one, let's sound it. K-I-P. K-I-P. Kip. Kip. Now, kip can be another word for bed or another word for sleep or nap. If I use it in a sentence, the boy got out of the kip. I did not take a kip because I wasn't tired. So we have kip. And remember, kip can be another word for bed or for nap or sleep. So you have kip. Next, we have another word here. Let's sound it out. K -i -n -k -i -n kin. Kin. Remember, you are the kin of your mommy and your daddy. And that's the picture of kin. Another one, we use this one to put our medicine. K -it. K -it. Kit. We put our medicine inside of this. It's the kit. Kit. Let's move on to another part of our class. And this one, let's match our words to their pictures and put them in the right box. So the first word, k -e -n, Ken. This is Ken, a boy. Where do we put the word or name Ken? Ken fits in number three. K E N N Ken. And remember, Ken should be capital K because it's a person's name, Ken. Another one, k. Mm, this is kin. You are the kin of your mommy and your daddy. Kin. Where can we put kin? Kin fits in number five. K-I-N. This is kin. Let's make a line. The next we have k -i -d, kid. Kid. The kid is a baby goat. And where can we put kid? Kid fits in number two. K-I and letter D. Kid. Another one. We have k. Mm, N and G has the mm sound together. King, to make the word king. The king is the partner of the queen. Where can we put king in number six? K, I, N, and letter G. That is king. Next, how about we move on to k, I, S, S. This is the word kiss. You can kiss your mommy and your daddy. And kiss fits in number one. K, I, SNS, that's kiss. The last word that we have here, k it, kit. You can put your kit in the, sorry, you can put your medicine in a kit, K, I, and letter T. So these are the words that we match together on the screen. We have kiss, kid, ken, kit. Kin and king. Now let's move on to another part of our class, and that is for the work time. We have our work time. The first work that we will need to do is to build the puzzle inside our booklet. See, my pictures might be different, but we almost have the same work. So let's fix this one. Fix your pictures. And you also need to trace. So I have here letter K. Don't forget to trace your name. And I have here the first one. It is the name of Ken. Remember to make your letter K, capital K for Ken. And color your picture. Another K word that I have here is kid. The baby goat is a kid. And you can color also your pictures once it's dried from pasting. And this one is kin. Remember, my pictures might be different, but we almost have the same work. Remember, you are the kin of your mommy and your daddy. This is kin. Color your pictures. Now, if you're not yet done with the work, it's okay. Pause this video. Play it again once you're done. I'll be moving to the next page. And we have the next pictures. We have kit. We have kick. Sorry, let me fix this one. This is kick. Then we have kiss. Trace your words. So we have kit. And write them also. This one is kick. 
when you do karate, you kick a lot, just like the man here. He is doing a kick up in the air. Then this one kiss, you can kiss your mommy when you want to show your love to her. Kiss. And just like what I have here, you can color your pictures to make it look neat and nice. So I have here the keywords kit, kick, and kiss. If you're not yet done with the work, it's okay. Pause this video, play it again once you're done. The next work is to match our words. So the first one we have can. Can. This is can. Can fits in number three. K. Make it capital K, K E N, Ken. Next, this is kin. Make a line. You are the kin of your mommy and your daddy. Kin fits in number five. This one kid, the baby goat, is a kid. It fits in number two, K I D, kid. Another one, king. This is king, and king fits in number six. The king is the partner of the queen. Another one, kiss. Kiss, this is kiss. K-I-S-S, -S. it fits in number four. Kiss. And the last one, kit. You can put your shot or your medicine in the kit. So these are the keywords that you need to read and match the pictures and write the correct word in the right box. If you're not yet done with the work, it's okay. Pause this video, play it again once you're done. I'll be moving to the next page. This time you need to trace your words. The first one is kid. The next is kin. And the last one is kit. Now, how about... We match the picture, kid. This is kid here and kin. And write the word, remember, kid, K-I-D, kin, K-I-N, and kid, K-I-T. These are the keywords that we have. Now, let's move on to the next part of our class. And that is to make the sentence. Now, if you're not yet done with the previous work, it's okay. Pause this video, play it again once you're done. Let's read our sentence. This is my kit. This is my kit. Let's build. This is my kit. This is my kit. And let's write the sentence. This is my kit and let's color our kit here we have kit if you're not yet done with the work it's okay pause this video play it again once you're done i'll be moving to the next sentence this is my kite build your sentence this sorry let me fix that one this is my Kite. And remember to write, this is my kite. And color your picture for kite. So now this will be the last page of the work for today. And I hope that you finished your work because I'll be giving you your sticker friend. Now your classmates already have theirs. For Kyle, I gave you Rocky. And for Marcos, I will be putting you here in Marshall. And just a reminder for those who did not pass yet the pictures for our Christmas party, please send it. In our group messenger, one solo Christmas picture near a Christmas tree or Christmas decoration background. And you have one family Christmas picture. And I hope to see you tomorrow on, sorry, on Monday because today is Friday. See you on Monday and I hope you finish your work today. Enjoy the weekend. Bye-bye.